Not one, but two playoff basketball games in the Barry Wednesday night for the Wildcats, both against the Cardinals from Saginaw Valley State. Up first was the men's team, who sat at 12-1 at home and had already beaten the Cards twice in the regular season, but everyone knows there aren't any guarantees when it comes to the postseason. SVSU came out knocking everything down in the first quarter, and they were up 10-5, looking poised offensively, but the Cats were just hitting their stride. Max Bjorklund hits the three, and then it's Dylan Keel stuffing it in transition, and you could tell this one was going to go back and forth all night. Halfway through the first half, NMU down six. It's Brian Parzik staring down the basket from deep. He's got the green release on this one to bring it back to a one-possession game. A few minutes later, Bjorklund's going to draw the help defense, dishes down low for guess who? Keel with another jam as this game was just heating up. But Northern still went into the break down four. The battle continued going into the second half. Here's Chauncey Willis Jr. with some nice touch off the glass, but the Wildcats were always quick to respond. On the other end of the floor, Sam Schultz gives it to Bjorklund, and he shows off the body control at the cup with this solid finish. Nearing the final 10 minutes of play, the Cardinals still had the upper hand. It's Willis again, this time with the Euro step through the paint for two, and Saginaw retained their six-point lead. It wasn't until there were only three minutes left in the game that the Cats took their first lead in 35 minutes of play. Bjorklund, the kick out to the corner, and Max Weisbrod steps up in one of the biggest moments of the true freshman's young career. NMU ahead, 65-64. From there, the environment in the Barry really started to take effect. Saginaw had to resort to some late fouls and wild shots to try and stay in it, but when the buzzer finally sounded, the boys were waving them goodbye courtside. The Wildcats win with a final of 75-66 and finish this year 13-1 on their home court. Northern's big three, if you will, were dominant on the night. Max Bjorklund led the squad with 23, Dylan Keel finished with a 19-point double-double, and Max Weisbrod added 14 of his own. Now, the challenge for the Cats? Do it again on the road. They traveled to Big Rapids to play Ferris State in the GLIAC semifinals Saturday at 4 o'clock. For the NMU Wildcats, I'm Kobe Manzo.